Hello, my name is Dr. Diwan S. Raja. Today I will discuss about the pharmacology of the ethosuximide. Ethosuximide is a primary anti epileptic drug. Ethosuximide is the drug of choice to treat absence seizure. We have other drugs for the absence seizure, like that of valproic acid, but ethosuximide is less toxic it has better outcome than that of valproic acid in the management of absence seizure because the valproic acid may cause hepatotoxicity more gastric irritation may cause alopecia ethosuximide has no no such adverse effects so this is the drug of choice to treat absence seizure. What is absence or petit mal seizure? This is a type of seizure. Seizure means here epilepsy begin in childhood and rarely persist into adolescence. The spell is two to five hours and are characterized by a brief loss of consciousness for five to ten seconds without loss of postural tone. Minor motor manifestation include blinking eyes and slim head turning with full orientation immediately after spell. So this is a childhood disease, absence, petit mal seizure. So what is the mode of action of ethosuximide, the drug of choice for absence of petit mal seizure. It decreases propagation of abnormal electrical activity in the brain, most likely by inhibiting T-type calcium channels. So how are the absorption and fate of ethosuximide? It is well absorbed orally and is not bounded to plasma protein. About 25% is excreted unchanged through the kidney. 75% of this drug is converted to inactive metabolites in the liver by the microsomal cytochrome P450 system. But ethosuximide does not induce P450 enzyme synthesis. The plasma half-life of ethosuximide is very prolonged. It is approximately 60 hours. So this drug can be taken once in a day. What are the adverse effects of ethosuximide? Adverse effects include, we have two types of adverse effects, common adverse effects and rare adverse effects. Common adverse effects include nausea, vomiting, drowsiness, lethargy, dizziness, restlessness, agitation, anxiety, and inability to concentrate. Rare adverse effects include urticaria on the skin, round elevation, Steven Johnson syndrome that involves skin mucous membrane, inside the mouth also and that may be fatal in certain situation leukopenia there is the low number of white blood cells thrombocytopenia low number of platelets aplastic anemia bone marrow suppression and systemic drug induced this drug induced sle or systemic lupus erythromatosis Drug interaction, co-administration of ethosuximide and valproic acid result in inhibition in the metabolism and excretion of the ethosuximide. And that's all about the pharmacology of the ethosuximide. If you have any question, please feel free to ask me. Please share the information with your friends. Please support my channel. Please subscribe me.
have a nice wonderful and blessed day bye now